listen to me. I took a long time preaching this message tonight. But listen to me, Zion. I plead with you in the Holy Ghost. We've got pastors here. We've got evangelists. We've got missionaries. We've got bishops. We've got, you name it. They've gathered in this building tonight. You've got some people that say, Brother Nathan, Elder Simmons, I refuse to just go through the motion. My question to you is this. When is the last time the Holy Ghost overshadowed you? when you weren't in church. My, 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 my problem is, do you remember when saints would be at the kitchen sink washing dishes and the spirit of prayer the anointing would overtake you. And you would be at the kitchen. Nobody, nobody there. Nobody there. Mama, nobody. Just you and Jesus. Just you and God. And the quickening of God. Oh, you didn't see. Yeah, God. You, you don't even see that anymore. Folks don't even stagger in the spirit like they used to is it just me or what but have you seen folks I'm, I'm talking about not in church in your house glory oh 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 somebody when is the last time God overshadowed you like that in your house. Ask them. That you gave in. And yielded to the Holy Ghost. Nobody was there to catch you. Nobody was there to see and hear. Nobody was there to impress. It was just you and Jesus. Listen, when is the last time you were driving your car? Now, you got to forgive me because I grew up with young people that were radical for Jesus. And before we would leave each other, because most times we had to take the train. But if one of them, you know, had a little struggy buggy and was able to borrow the car from somebody and... We went all out to sing or whatever the case may be or the revival or whatever it was. Before we left one another as young people, we would pray. And the car would get all fogged up the windows. It was the same way every way. I can't hear nobody. But there was a different level of commitment. Uh, may I ask you a question? Have you noticed? May forgive me. I, I'm sorry. I, I don't mean to do it like this. Have you noticed that people don't look happy anymore? I, I, now I'm not talking about the world now. I'm talking about saints. They have a frown. They, they have a heaviness. They have a mean look, mean disposition. We used to be sweetly saved and have sweet countenance. And when you saw us, we were, God bless you, praise the Lord. Now we call that drama. We say that's acting, it's not real. I gotta be me. Saints used to smile. They, they, they're so unhappy that even when they shout. Have you ever, see I'm, I'm wrong because I came up in the joy time. 
when he was the joy of my salvation. Yes, he is. But if you notice, folks, when they shout now, they even shout like they're not happy. Maybe that's not going on in your church. Have you noticed? How many remember? How many remember when the saints would dance and have a smile? And you could hear the, the, the joyful noise. Remember that? They go to whoa, glory. And they go to, you know, and the brothers, when they got the Holy Ghost came on them, oh, glory to God, hallelujah, woo, glory. Y'all hypocrites, I can't hear nobody. My problem is, something is wrong. But tonight in this service, God said, Nathan, I want the real saints to get their joy back, to get their peace back, to get their hope back, to get their love back, to get their prayer life back, to get their anointing back. Saints, they don't even sing it. They don't sing it. But they used to say, He's a joy of my salvation. Yes, He is. He's a joy of my salvation. Tell your neighbor, he's the joy. He, he, the big he, the big I am. My salvation. Oh, yes, he is. They don't even, they, they don't, they don't sing it anymore. Something within me that holdeth the rain. Something within me that that just pain. Something I cannot. on your belly and say, all that I know, there is something, something with me, oh Lord. do this you have to make a circle of three make a circle of three get three persons and turn around and tell the persons around you would you please spread out a little bit because I I need some room because I don't know what the Holy Ghost going to do with me tonight 
Tonight, I'm going to ask you to do this. I'm going to ask you to take the persons by the hand and say to them these words. Say of all nights, if you ever prayed before, I need you to pray for me tonight. I know what that boy is talking about. I know what that young man is talking about. I, I, I remember, I, I remember, I remember when, I remember when I didn't think the worst before thinking the best. When I didn't see no evil and hear no evil and when I, when I really wanted to be saved and I did everything within my power to follow peace with all men. Holiness without which no man shall see the Lord. I remember when I wasn't mean and when I wasn't so irritable. When I used to be sweetly saved. To the pure all things are pure. I remember when my love for God superseded my love for anything else. When I made up my mind and my testimony was, I'll take Jesus for mine. I'll take Jesus. This whole wide world, but I take Jesus for mine, 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 mine. I'm gonna ask you tonight. I'm going to ask you tonight, please. Go back and get your joy. Go back and get your anointing. Listen to me, listen, listen. Tell the person you're holding hands with if you can. Tell them whatever you do tonight, Go back and get your joy. Go back and get your joy. Get your peace. Get your anointing back. Get your love back. For God and the saints. I said for God and the saints. God bless you, my heart. I want you to tell God to search you. Pick that man up in the spirit. Pick that woman up in the Holy Ghost. While I'm down here praying. Touch my heart. Oh God. 
Yes, Lord, I yield to you. I surrender to your plan. I can tell my cabinet. I shall never ever catch up. He comes to the other hole. He is the other side. He is the other side. He comes to the other hole. He comes to the other side. Oh, ho, ho, ho. Yes, Lord, in the name of Jesus. Somebody to help me. How did I stop being 
Lord, the Holy Ghost be on you now. There it is. I, oh, oh! The power of the Holy Ghost. The anointing of God. Come on, Zion. I said, come on here. Get your breakthrough. Get your breakthrough. Oh, shut up. I do a Lord in my Oh, shut up. Get your breakthrough. Get what you need. Come on, the other Masa. Jesus name. The power of the Holy Ghost. Oh God, the anointing on you, baby. A shout of the He come over the anointing of God. Who shall be the power of the Holy Ghost? The, the anointing of God. Come on, Zion. Get your breakthrough here. Come on, I dare you. I said, I dare you. I said, I act the anointing. The power of God is on you. Who there it is. Oh, shut. Come on, Zion. Oh, the power. Shout the other one. Oh, shut. God's Come on, Zion. Clap your hands. Open up your mouth. He come the power. Come on, Zion. Come on, Zion. Get your breakthrough. Tonight is the night. God's power is on you now. He come the Lord. You cried your last tear. I said you cried your last tear. God said it's over now. Now watch me do it. Oh, yes, Lord. Yes, Lord. Yes, Lord. Oh, oh God. Hallelujah. I said, Hallelujah. Church said, Hallelujah. I said, Church said, Hallelujah. I said, Come on, church. Come on, church. You might as well get what you need. You might as well get your power back. You might as well get your body back. So he come to me outside of how I'm gonna be a kitchen. Oh, 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 my 
all over this building tonight. I want to be a shout of the baby. Oh God. Oh, oh, oh. We go. I feel the anointing in this house. I said, I. Good God. Oh, we. Hey, hey, we're gonna stop. I promise I am. I promise I am. But I want you to go to as many people as you can on your way back to your seat. And I want you to tap them in the belly. Ladies, ladies, men, men. And I want you to tell them, and God be God in you. But now hold on, stop, wait. Don't let nobody tap you in the belly if they don't feel the anointing of God first. I can't hear nobody. Because when they tap you, there ought to be a connection. It ought to be like an explosion. An igniting of a new anointing. You gonna go one way. They gonna go another. You gonna go to running. They gonna go to leaping. You gonna fall out. They gonna go to rolling. Come on. Tap them on the belly three times at the end. On the way back to your seat. The last thing, next to last thing I've got to obey God and do. God said to tell you these words. He said, get ready for the Holy Ghost turn around. I want you to do me a favor and begin, go, as you go back to your seat, I want you to be, do this in the Holy Ghost and don't wait on nobody, wait on nothing. I want you to turn around and say, I'm in the Holy Ghost turn around. Listen, stay right where you are. Now listen to me. Mm, pick her up. Pick her up. Lift your hands, dear. Lift your hands. Pick up again. Mm. I feel the anointing. I feel the power of God. I feel the fire. Shut up. Shut up. Shut up. Shut up. Shut up. Shut up. 
Oh. Now listen. Asha tabaka sikutasha. Horaka satabaka she. Horebaka sata. Oh, I'm, I'm, I'm sorry. Ah, glory. See, I, I, I'm sorry, but then I'm not. Because the anointing that we feel right now is not just for now. This anointing is because you are going to literally terrorize the devil. somebody to stop on the devil's speak in tongues use your language fight your devil in your spirit come on ever shut up run up on the theater run down on the motion of the Listen, hear me, hear me, hear me, no don't hear me, hear God, people are stretched all out all over this place, he korabakashata, he korabababansataya, fukusia, fukatabasha, fukosataba, listen, I'm gonna stop, I promise I'm gonna stop. Oh God. God said that you must do this and then I'm gonna, I'm gonna stop. He said, you've got to take it like you're anointed to do this. Anything that's on, anything that's tried to block, anything that's tried to stop from sickness, I can hear nobody to sin. You're gonna literally, you're going to literally do your hands in the spirit like this. Now, I don't have hakarosha. Listen, in the Holy Ghost, I want you to run over to somebody in the spirit, and I want you to take them just like I did that young man and say, Now listen to me, I need to see the hands of every person in this building that knows the voice of God. Let me see your hands. Touch your neighbor and say, I know God's voice. I know how to hear him. I know when he speaks. This is what the Lord said. I have no tricks. I have no skill.
Father. God, help me up in this place. I'm going to stop. I'm going to stop. I'm sorry. And these are the words that God said to me, and I'm going to stop and hand it over to the brother. He said these words, repeat after me. I don't care what I go through. I don't care who takes me through. I don't care what's going on right now. I'm not going to let anything. Oh, hold your knees. Say, I'm not going to let anything take me any lower than my knees. Now we're going to stop, but I want everybody in the building that feels like it, that don't feel like it. If you know that God is going to be God in you like never before, I want you, if you don't do nothing but run around your section, get up out of your seat in the Holy Ghost right about now and go to running and say, God, you're mighty, you're mighty, you're mighty, you're mighty. You're... Subscribe to the channel. Our God is an awesome God. He reigns forever and ever. Lift him up. Lift him up. Lift him up. Come on.